Hello YouTube and welcome back to the next AVM Fritz box repeater. We just put it in and then we give him a few seconds to boot up. Just wait until the power LED stops blinking. Okay, there we go. And now we push the VPS button for six seconds. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, this is what we want. We want the Wi Fi LED start blinking. This means it's now in the VPS searching mode and we have to go to our router. So here we are with our router. It's also a Fritz box from AVM. It's a top model, it's a 7390 version and it doesn't have a separate VPS button. You just have to push the uh, Wi-Fi button. And again, you see the Wi-Fi LED here. Uh, we push it for six seconds and then the Wi-Fi LED starts blinking too. So now both devices are trying to search and find each other. Let's go back to the repeater. So here we are back with our repeater and you can already see it's stopped blinking. So the both devices are connected. Uh, over here it shows us the uh, Wi-Fi strengths. We got one, two, three, four, five LEDs that indicate the strengths of our, our Wi-Fi network. Uh, we got our power LED, we got our Wi-Fi LED and we got our Ethernet LED. And this VPS button has um, three functions. Number one, you push it for one second. Uh, you can turn off Wi-Fi, you can turn Wi-Fi off and on. Number two, you push it for six seconds and you are going into the uh, Wi-Fi and router search mode. Uh, this is what we just did. And number three, you push it for 15 seconds and you reset it. So, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video and I could help you guys. Bye and see you next time.